morning everyone and welcome to the vlog. So I'm part way ready, not totally ready. I have a braid today. I just made my coffee, got my breakfast, made bottles and McKinnon has been playing down here. She's been very content playing down here this morning. Haven't you? How are you? <laughs> and Henry's eating the tree. Pretty normal. So McKinnon woke up for the first time in a while in the middle of the night last night. Lately, she's been going to bed around 11, which is normal for her, and waking up at like seven, and then she'll go back to sleep until 10-ish. Um, but last night she woke up at 4. She went to bed at the same time and woke up at 4. I look dead. Anyway, she woke up at 4 and so I fed her. She went back to sleep and then she didn't wake up until 10.30. Yeah, so it was a little weird. She woke up, her like first feeding was a little earlier. So that's weird. Anyway, I'm going to feed her. I gotta edit the vlog and yeah, get started with the day. Y'all, I have to brag on this little girl. She is so good at tummy time. Look at you, you're so strong. You are so strong. Yeah, you wanna eat the little, your, the, your little uh, crinkly book. I don't really know what that's called. Look at you, you're so strong. You're so strong. <laughs> She got her legs kicking back here. Okay, are you done? We were using this, but she was liking this more. Did you have a good tummy time? Oh, look, there you are. There you are. Wave hi. Oh, you just wanna eat your hand? All right, that's cool too. So I'm about to do a workout. <laughs> this little girl is down here playing. I gave her this crinkle book because she loves those. Right? You do. <laughs> I get to wear my new Nikes for my workout. Super excited. And of course I'm wearing super silly socks with them. <laughs> but I'm excited to do a workout with tennis shoes that fit me. A few moments later. Well, that was a really good workout. <laughs> I did um, dance fitness. I don't know if anyone has ever done that before. It seems like it's really easy. It's totally not, but it's a lot of fun. I'll put the link to the YouTube um, because the girl who does it has a YouTube channel and she does a lot of videos on there for songs. And it's always like really fun songs that everyone loves. Like she's done Look What You Made Me Do, um, Can't Stop the Feeling. I'm trying to think of like other ones. She has a lot of country songs too. I, country songs are really easy to do like dance fitness to in my opinion because I feel like a lot of country songs are written to like fit line dancing or two step and being a girl from Texas <laughs> that's the kind of dancing that I've done a whole lot although I was a cheerleader so I did all of that dance stuff too but anyway I'm getting way off topic. That was a really good workout. You probably can't tell, but I am like major sweating, super shiny. Um, I'll probably do a couple more songs later, but that was fun. Did you have fun watching mommy do her dance workout? She's loving her little crinkle book over there. She loves those things right now. Like there's this, it crinkles. I think there's some other, yeah, these right here. And she loves them, don't you? And she's liking being able to chew on stuff right now too. Aren't you? You're so cute. Okay, I'm really gross and I need to go and wash my face. So yeah, I'm gonna go do that because I look disgusting. I'm talking a whole lot and I need to go and stretch. So I'm gonna hurt my foot if I don't stretch. For those of you who have been around for a while, I don't know if y'all remember when I got like a stress fracture in my foot a while back um, and I had to wear that stupid boot. Um, well, I didn't wear it for as long as I was supposed to. So occasionally it starts to hurt, like my foot starts to hurt again um, when I do like more intense workouts, like not ballet beautiful, but ones that are a little more fast paced or when I run or stuff like that. So if I don't stretch, 
um, it usually hurts more. If I don't stretch afterwards, like stretch my foot out and everything, then it'll just start to feel worse. So I'm gonna go stretch, and this little girl I think is wanting to play, so I'm gonna play with her. Look who's holding her own bottle. I mean, she's not eating, but she took it out of my hands. Like, she kept pushing my hand off, getting really frustrated. So, I let her take it. But I think now she's getting frustrated because she can't eat. She wants to hold it, but she can't feed herself yet. Here, I'm putting this burp cloth around her because I'm trying to keep it from going in her little neck rolls. Do you want it right now or not? Are you just wanting to hold your bottle? You really just want to hold your bottle? <laughs> You're so cute. Oh my gosh. Oh, don't pull my hair, please. Do you like the Christmas music? Hi, baby. <laughs> you like it? <laughs> You're so cute. So we had some fun playing earlier. I got this out for her. She usually has this with us um, in the car lately um but it's one of her favorites so i brought it in i put this garland up you can see it goes over the frames um <laughs> covers our faces like perfectly right there <laughs> but over here it goes just right above them perfectly because you know matthew me and it goes whoop. <laughs> i also set up the bow tree ta-da lighting up this little corner in the kitchen thought that was a good place for it because now i can come in the kitchen i don't have to have those fluorescent lights on i can just have the tree on and i have perfect amount of light it's like a candlelight kind of feel i think mckinnon's getting hungry but i got those things up i'm gonna kind of change up some ornaments on the tree um because i didn't put on a couple of sets of ornaments this year just because i felt like we had a lot of the like bobble ornaments so i'm gonna kind of move some stuff around because it looks a little clumpy in some areas because i was anticipating like needing more room usually when we put all the ornaments on there's like barely enough room for everything but i think i'm gonna change it up a bit home alone is on the tv our tree is looking pretty mckinnon is down here playing in just her diaper <laughs> Hi, McKinnon. Oh, you look sad. She's probably gonna want to eat here in a minute. Um, oh, he got it. Anyway, um, Matthew's home and he's being an awesome husband and washing all the bottle stuff. Why? Okay, <laughs> many things are happening right now. What? One, you're on manual focus, and two, you are the coloring is so bad. I don't know how to fix things on this camera. Are you on the right setting again? Do you just push buttons for fun? <laughs> no, the Stop only, the only buttons recording. I push are the power. Yeah. Apparently I'm terrible at filming with this camera. Oh, look. I mess things up constantly. This little autofocus thing here too changes it to manual focus. So you must yeah. be, when you're flipping up the screen while you're recording, you must be tapping that. Oh, yeah. Must be. I think we can turn that button off. Yeah, we should. Otherwise, I'm just gonna keep turning it. I love this Christmas tree here. Oh, Christmas tree! Just kidding. I'm not gonna sing. Matthew, I ate a lot of this popcorn today because we didn't have any food here. I ate the rest of it. Ha! Ah, just kidding. When you yeah. see, <laughs> I saw it. Oh, you did. I did. <laughs> I took a bite so I could at least have a couple of kernels before you eat the rest you of You can't before. judge me because we don't have any food. So I just got out of the shower, obviously. Ugh. McKinnon and I watched the Rockefeller Christmas tree. I don't really know. Rockefeller Center Christmas tree lighting. Is that what it is? I don't know. Um, but we watched it tonight. McKinnon seemed very impressed by all the lights on the Christmas trees. I say trees because there were like trees on the stage sets and all that she really likes christmas lights we have learned that or really just really cool bright lights in general she likes <laughs> but anyway i'm gonna wrap up the vlog matthew and i are planning out our friday um because we're gonna spend the day at disney on friday so exciting i know we kept saying like oh we're going to disney springs on this day we're going to disney springs on this day now it all got kind of like messed up because of Matthew's schedule and then last minute I had to go to the dentist. But we're going to Magic Kingdom on Friday and <laughs> that was 
Matthew. Zerberting <laughs> her belly. <laughs> I think we should also go to Hollywood Studios. Jingle bell, jingle bam. And the seasons or something, holiday season. I don't know, really know what it is. I forget I the know. name all the time. But, you know, the projection on uh, Tower of Terror. No, it's Hollywood Toy Tower. Oh, my bad. And then you it snows. It? it snows, too. Yeah. <laughs> So, yeah, I think we should go check that out, like, in the evening. Head over there. Guess what time Magic Kingdom closes tomorrow? What time? 4.30. Really? Guess what's happening at 4.30? What? Nobody's allowed in. They're having a cast member appreciation thing. <gasps> That's so cool. There's no party, nothing. So is, um, John going to be there? Like, what is it? Are they doing, like, a party for them? Oh. How do you even know about it? Okay. Well, McKinnon is eating her swaddle. She's obviously hungry. Oh, hi, Riley. By the way, Riley spent part of the day in my closet. Locked in my closet. Um, but I don't think she really cared that much because she didn't meow or anything. And we were here in the bedroom talking and playing with McKinnon. She was in the closet, had no idea. She knew we were out here, obviously, because we were making noise, and she showed zero desire to get out. I didn't know she was in there until Henry was, like, reaching under the closet door, and I was like, what are you doing? And I opened the door, and there's Riley. <laughs> so, anyway, okay, these are lots of long stories. Um, all to say, it's time to wrap it up, so thanks for watching. If you're new, don't forget to subscribe, and if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, or share, comment, whatever you'd like to do. I love talking to y'all down in the comments. My goal is to talk as quickly as possible. All right, see y'all tomorrow. Bye!